I'm in Brighton, the sun's out, my g I've got a short sleeve shirt on, and what better way to spend my day off than down the beach? Do you fancy joining me? Come on. There's um, quite an array of different sands uh, at Brighton Beach. Here we have some, um, some, large, some large adult sand. Uh, I know a lot of you are used to the kind of small, um, small grainy sand that will easily get caught underneath your, your foreskin, um, your, your toes. Because I think it's glass, isn't it? Isn't sand made of glass? Try to put the sand back where you found it uh, so as not to upset the wildlife uh, of sand experts. Oh, look, I found a specimen. Seaweed, um, I believe an Asian cuisine. I should probably put it back in the sea um, because it's quite dry. You just cut that so it looks like it goes in the sea. <laughs> These bee chuts uh, were built in the 50s to encourage a lot of postcard photography, but after the um, great postcard pulpage of the 80s, now they're mostly used as a very small sex clubs and for Tupperware storage. Can I have a go? As you can see, um, the rocks here are quite big, um, so it is quite hard to get comfortable. So I'm going to show you a couple of ways of how to get real comfy when you're lounging on the sand. You build a, you build a sort of bridge for your arch of your back, and then you can really feel, really feel them work in your spine. If you sort of drag yourself a groove, and you kind of lay flat down, uh, the sun can get to your, to your buttocks, um, the back of your legs, and behind your ears, which I find is the palest place, at least on my body. Brighton is famous for being quite a diverse, quite an accepting city, but the bicycle community is banned from the promenade. Oi! I'll call the sea police! You, ca you can't drink it, can you? Oh, this is full of salt. Uh, the salt tastes horrible. Um, although, do fish need to drink? Or because they're, because they're surrounded by water, they don't have to drink because they're always very moist. The best person also is ask about whether fish need water um, will be the fish themselves. I fish! Give us a clue! One thing you can do is um, write messages to space in the sand. Um, what would you like to say to an astronaut? Well, I know what I'd like to say. How do you spell arrogant? The two R's. I hope that's spelt right. There's no dictionaries in the fucking C. Well, I don't think so. There might be. Watch out. You can find a lot of treasures, a lot of sustenance on the beach. I here have found this budgie cracker. And well, if it's good enough for your budgie, then it's good enough for me. Um, don't do that. Oh, it's like a concrete fish. I, I may have found a scientific and I may have found a scientific and I found this in the sand. It could be a skeleton. Oh no, it's just a big rock. It's another big rock. They just, there's just a massive rocks in here. You can't be comfortable on this beach. Well, there we have it. My day at the beach. Uh, I've had a really lovely time. Uh, well, I hope you've, you've, you've both learned something, not only about the beach, but about yourselves as well. Um, but I can't come down here without having a lovely dip in the sea. I'll see you in there.